it's your girl queen manifest here welcome back to my lovely beautiful spiritual sacred highly energetic youtube channel queen manifest period if you are new to my channel i would like to welcome you guys um my channel consists of a lot of different type of content so make sure that you hit that subscribe button and also hit that post notification bell so that you can stay up to date on when your girl is posting these hot videos because that's just what it is and that's just that on that if you're back you already know this is going to be a dope video and today i am going to go over with you guys how queen stays healthy okay i'm gonna share with you guys my health tips some of my routines some of the things that i do throughout the week my weekly schedule what that kind of looks like as far as you know the things that i do to stay feeling good honey a he healthy body is a happy body excuse me yes I had a little bit to drink anyways <laughs> so without further ado I'm going to go ahead and get into this video make sure that you subscribe to this channel hit that post notification bell and y'all go ahead and get into this video okay period so the first thing that I would like to go over as far as like one of the main things that I do to maintain my health and just making sure that I'm as soon as I wake up, I'm getting everything working and moving and started on the inside is I will drink either alkaline water or I will just drink water, period. So water for sure. Water is just, you know, pure. So it's one of the most purest things that we ingest, take in. So I make sure that that's the first thing that touches my insides, my organs. It would definitely have to be water. It's a yes for me. <laughs> The next thing is that I'm going to add to the water thing. So sometimes if I'm not having alkaline water and I'm just drinking regular faucet water, then I will most definitely um, have apple cider vinegar in that water. So it'll be like a full glass of water or a full bottle of water. Um, and then it'll just have like two capfuls of apple cider vinegar. And I know a lot of people are not really into apple cider vinegar, but it definitely helps a lot when it comes to health and just making you feel better and look better and just going down that whole health road. So apple cider vinegar is definitely a plus. Um, all right. And after I, have you know, kind of got some fluid flowing through me, period, um <laughs> i definitely make sure that i have a low carb breakfast so low carb breakfast would be like some scrambled eggs and some bacon or either some sunny side up eggs you know what i'm saying with some bacon this morning for example i actually had um i had some sunny side up eggs and i actually had some turkey bacon along with that and just a little glass of orange juice you know just to yeah <laughs> and so definitely make sure that dieting throughout the day is low carb because the less carbs you gotta burn you know what i'm saying bam um and then after that i always will incorporate some sort of exercise into my day and i have a schedule a regimen where i do two days on one day off so i work out four days out of the week um, so I tend to take three days off, four days on, and then I'll do some sort of exercise, whether that's walk, run, squats. I do exercise indoor and outdoor. Um, so I know there's a lot of stuff going on right now, but girl, better get into it, honey. <sighs> so some of the other things that I do other than eating right and exercising that I do to make sure that I'm staying healthy and health for me is like a big thing. So health is more than just like the way you look and feel like so feeling healthy, looking healthy, great, but mentally being healthy as well. So something that helps me stay mentally stable would be marijuana. You know what I'm saying? Hey, anyway, <laughs> so I definitely every morning when I wake up, I will definitely, you know, do what I got to do and get where I need to be 
Um, and so that is something that helps me because um, it just leads into staying stress-free. So I'm very big on that, staying stress-free, because stress is something that causes people a lot of health hazards. And a lot of um, stress is something that just puts people's health at risk, rather. And so I'm definitely not about to be one of them people. Fuck you, thought. Excuse me, but don't. No. But yes, so um, definitely just, you know, just to get my mind right and, you know, mellow out, stress relief, everything like that. I'm very big on that because stress can cause heart attacks, strokes, weight gain, all of those things that we do not want and need for ourselves and definitely things that are not healthy or good for your health. So definitely maintaining a stress-free environment, period. And after that, um, I do say that meditation, having self time is another thing and a good way to maintain your health because taking that time to yourself helps out with your mental health because a lot of times, a lot of us have a lot of things on our mind. We got a lot of stuff going on. We're going through situations and things and whatever and whatnot. And having that time to yourself and being able to relax and think and hear yourself think and what's going on in your brain and stuff that's very healthy for you because you need that in order to keep it together when everything's just all over the place that's when people get the spasm and flipping and depression and we're not doing that over here no ma'am so just all in all with those last two tips would be maintaining a positive environment keeping your energy pure keeping your energy clean period and i'm gonna take a sip of wine on that note Yes, 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 yes. What is that? Mm, okay. Yes, and so after that, another thing that I do that helps with um just getting yourself on a healthier, you know, like healthier balance would be not eating after eight o'clock. Cut it out. Stop it. If you're not gonna exercise or get up and be active and move around and do something, you don't need to eat nothing not after eight o'clock not after eight o'clock because if you're just gonna lay down and go to sleep and relax and chill and you're not gonna be active then you're gonna eat and then it's just gonna pile up because you're not burning those calories so i do not eat after 8 p.m don't do it and my last thing that i do for myself um another health tip something that i do um i'm very in tune like with my growth like as far as my hair, spiritually, mentally, physically, all of those type of things. So um, I've been doing a hair mask on my hair and I want to share those things with you guys. And I also want to share a couple of um, drinks, juices that I drink that are very healthy just to give you guys some insight on some of the stuff that I drink. So first about the hair mask. I do a hair mask three times a week and it consists of raw honey, mayo, olive oil and two eggs and one avocado period and you can get any of that stuff from walmart kroger piggly wiggly and whatever whoever <laughs> okay so those products and then i just mix them together and blend it all together you might need a blender because avocado can be real chunky and everything like that and you don't want chunks of avocado just everywhere because that's not really something that's fun to clean up trust me i'd have been real irritated after that whole experience so just make sure you blend it and then um doing the hair mask keeping that hair mask on my hair for like 45 minutes to an hour every time i do the um the, the routine and so this is my second week doing it i did it today um i did it like two days ago and so I'm just really excited to see those results. Um, I'm just all about promoting good health and growth. And so my hair is also something that I want to keep healthy. And then also just remembering that if you're ingesting something and it's good for the inside, then it will it'll be good for the outside as well. So y'all just keep that in mind, you know what I'm saying? Now, a couple of different juices that I drink that help with you know, just maintaining good health and not taking in a whole bunch of sugar. And a lot of drinks have um, high fructose corn syrup. And I just ain't rolling with that. I'm not. I don't think I really drink anything with high fructose corn syrup. Anywho, 
Um, so one of the drinks that I drink and this brand is awesome. They are so good. Um, I drink these different juices. This is the brand name. And it's just like, you can just read the ingredients. I'll have everything in the description box below, but everything is all natural. And honey, that's what it is. You know what I'm saying? So that's what I need. And the taste is amazing. Like, like amazing. All right. And another one that I drink um, is Sarah's homegrown and then it has the name and this is the aqua fresha and this is the aqua fresh freshka and this is the mango flavor and that's the brand name and this is very healthy as well the ingredients everything is all natural i'll have this in the description box as well um these definitely both would be very very highly recommended as far as you know just juices and things because we we do like to have things with flavor for sure and on top of flavor we just need it to be healthy so that's definitely what these are for sure and and so yeah you know what i'm saying bye <laughs> I'm just playing, but y'all know your girl gonna have her wine every now and then. Anyway, I really enjoyed doing this video for you guys. Y'all can hit me up on my Facebook at Queen Queen Goddess. Y'all can hit me up on Instagram at The Queen Naturally. Y'all can follow me on Snapchat at Real Goddess 100. Tap in if you have any questions or concerns or any commentary about any of the products that I use to maintain everything that I do. Um, I definitely don't mind going over any of that or doing a video on any of those things um like i said make sure you do subscribe to this dope channel get all this good sauce and this good juice and these good vibes and this good energy period every single time for sure um and yeah hit that post notification bell so y'all can stay up on my videos and i am going to go ahead and head out and i hope that y'all enjoyed this video and i will see you guys in my next video it has been a pleasure i hope that you guys definitely gained something from this and i will see y'all next time your girl is out Mwah. from now on we make love girl let's catch up phone calls ain't enough that's where i mess